Hi, Philip Hondo here. I want to give a quick uh, pipeline update. We talked about the Blackfin Pipeline project. Uh, it starts out in uh, Colorado County, passes uh, north of Houston uh, down to Jefferson County. Um, we got new information, uh, Blackfin, and it's, it's connected with Whitewater, also the company that uh, is doing the Big Matterhorn project. This is a smaller project, but still very significant, very large diameter pipe. Uh, we understand it's a 42 inch line. Uh, they uh, are getting very aggressive with seeking temporary access. Uh, they are getting temporary restraining orders from the court, setting temporary injunction hearings uh, with, uh, I'm gonna say very minimal attempt to contact or, or get access agreements from, from landowners. So. Um, not unusual, frankly, the same uh, play out of the playbook that Matterhorn did on the Matterhorn project or Whitewater. And this is once again a Whitewater project. They called it Blackfin uh, Pipeline Project. So, uh, you know, large natural gas um, pipeline project, high pressure. And so uh, you as a landowner, if you're being contacted, asked about uh, temporary access, that's something that uh, you should talk to an attorney about understand uh, the rights and the limitations that you can ask for with their uh, access uh, by them getting a temporary restraining order. I'm gonna put, a, I'm gonna put an example of this, uh, these uh, applications and petitions for a temporary restraining order and temporary injunction uh, so that you can see what it looks like. This one comes from uh, Liberty County. They're doing this all in the various counties when necessary. So I want you to, to understand what these things mean uh, when they do obtain a temporary uh, restraining order, it's what they get uh, directly from the court. Uh, and uh, when, once you're serve, served with it and once they deposit, there's a bond requirement, uh, it is effective on you. And so, uh, and then normally there's a very, uh, well, short time frame in which there's going to be a temporary injunction hearing. The pipeline company, Blackfin, uh, is attempting to make that temporary restraining order uh, last longer under the temporary injunction at the temporary injunction hearing. So uh, all these things you need to be aware of, don't disregard them, don't um, you know, throw it away and not take any action. So uh, hopefully this information is helpful. Once again, Blackfin Pipeline Alert, Phil Hundle here. Uh, consult uh, the blog textcondemnationrights.com for more information, uh, more videos, hopefully these uh, videos are helpful. Thanks.